Hey Jay, this is Paul giving you a call. I wanted to let you know that we did receive your entry into the staycation. Um, are you familiar with what the staycation is and what all it includes? All right, cool. So just kind of quick question on that. What do you think is going to be your most favorite part of the staycation? Okay, excellent. So quick question, if you don't mind me asking on this, um, have you seen any of our videos on Facebook where we do the thousand dollar test drive giveaway? Okay, are you familiar with what that process is and how that works? Okay, cool. So what I'd like to do is even see if I could get you entered into the thousand dollar giveaway. I mean, what would be better than to do a staycation and then plus get another thousand dollars? No guarantee, but you know, hey, the odds are in your favor. The way I could get you entered into that, and uh, here it is, uh, the car you're driving today, would you be interested in trading it in, getting rid of it, if I could get you a car payment that's around the same? Okay, what about saving any money? Would you be interested in saving any money on the vehicle that you're driving right now? Or maybe your wife, or maybe you've got a child in the household? Okay, so you're good. All right, so what I'm gonna do is uh, I'll let you know if you win the staycation, but I really appreciate you entering that. And uh, I'm gonna send you my contact information. If you need any help, let me know. All right, appreciate it. All right, what do you guys think? So out of the 500 leads that we got for that, and is that 500 over what time period of leads? So that's the last three or four weeks. So on those 500, all of them have a lead score attached to them. Okay, so why don't we start with the ones that have the highest lead score first, so we're really distributing our time, and go after those and then just start working down. I mean, because yeah, a lot of the lead scores could be low because they're wanting that, that free staycation, they're wanting to do that. But I kind of look at the value of this. This is individuals that know our name, know our dealership, have filled in a lead form, we're retargeting them so they're going to see our ads, that it just makes a lot of sense, in, in my opinion, to be able to distribute those leads or those opportunities, let's not call them leads yet, just opportunities, and get the salespeople just calling them. And if they, you know, how many salespeople do we have and divide that, if they could just, you know, make five phone calls that would be great. And with that phone call too, I mean, what do you guys think about this? That we make the phone call, we don't get them on the phone. I mean, we're gonna get a lot of voicemails because people are at work. And then we just send a quick text. And the text could be something like, hi, I just wanted to let you know that we did receive your, your entry into the staycation. Do you have any questions about it? Right, yeah, they wanna get you off the phone as quick as possible, but if you can engage them in a conversation other than trying to buy a vehicle, they're going to talk to you. Get them thinking about that staycation. What are they gonna do? What's gonna be fun? What's their most favorite part? Hey, by the way, you know we give away $1,000 for everybody who does a test drive. The only thing they can say, I mean the vast majority of the people when you ask them about the $1,000, they're gonna say, no, I don't know about it. And then you wanna bring that barrier down because chances are they're thinking, yeah, whatever, that's just a sales ploy, that doesn't really happen. Hey, would you like me to send you a video of some of the past winners? We've had some really cool winners, you know, some really cool things that's happened. I mean, you guys have got some good stories. Because keep in mind, the people that are at work and the thing that they don't want to be doing, the vast majority of people do not want to be working. So if you get them on the phone, they're going to be willing to talk to you. Just by those 500 people and us reaching out and calling them and putting, a, you know, a voice with the dealership is going to mean so much to them that they're going to remember you guys. We might not get a sale from them this month, but they're gonna remember who you are. As a business owner, you're focused on the big things and you're taking the little things for granted. I'm talking specifically about phone skills for your team. It's such a little thing, you think it's so easy because it's easy to you, but that's why you built this company. You're losing a tremendous amount of opportunities because your team does not have the confidence, the know-how, and the skill to handle those phone calls properly. A phone call, chances are, is that first line of communication that that prospective customer is going to have with your business. And when your team doesn't have the confidence or the skills to handle that phone call properly, you are losing very expensive opportunities. How much money are you spending on advertising, marketing, and, and everything else, trade shows, everything you're doing to get that opportunity for the sale just to lose it over the phone? I encourage you to call or text to find out more about our phone skills program, or visit the website listed on this video to sign up today. I'm telling you, phone skills training is important because you're taking those little things for granted.